ஹலோ ஐ எம் டாக்டர் பாலசுப்ரமணியன் தியாகராஜன் நவ் இன் அவர் கண்டினியூயிங் டுட்டோரியல் பெட்டனிங் டு ஸ்கிரைபர்ஸ் யூ சப்ஸ்கிரைபர்ஸ் ஐ விட் லைக் டு ஷோ தி யூஸ் ஆஃப் ஸ்கிரிப்ட்ஸ் பைத்தான் ஸ்கிரிப்ட்ஸ் வித் இன் ஸ்கிரைபர்ஸ் யூஸ் ஆஃப் தீஸ் பைத்தான் ஸ்கிரிப்ட்ஸ் ஹெல்ப் அஸ் டு ஆட்டோமேட் த வேரியஸ் டாஸ்க்ஸ் விச் நீட்ஸ் டு பி பெர்ஃபார்ம் டு கிரியேட் அ பர்ஃபெக்ட் லே அவுட் within scribes so these some of the basic scripts are listed under script and so these are some of the basic scripts which are available within the scribes for example aligning image in the frame to create quotation sort a quote to make to select a line and click out a quote it will make it a quote and then convert you add a caption to the image frame by clicking this and then you can add color to con- convert color to comma separated value you can use uh, create a color chart we can uh, convert a comma separated value to color you can directly import image you can sample the various fonts available in the system by using this font sample you can create a image gallery using the image and then you can import a uh, comma separated value into a table by clicking this and then you can also use this info box to create to exactly know the information pertaining to the table or image box and these things are basic scripts are available within the scribes there are some more scripts even if you are knowledgeable enough to create your own scripts within python you can create those scripts and automate your routine tasks which you perform under python now one important useful script is you can use this calendar wizard to create a calendar design a calendar within scribes now first thing we will use this align image frame to ensure that we arrange the uh, image into the frame as we like so now we have imported a image now i will go to the script go here align image to the frame i want to align it say down it is down so similarly you select go to script align image to frame so push there it just goes so this is one way of aligning image into the frame supposing you want to add a caption underneath this image where you can type the details of the image you just select this image frame go to script and then you just go to caption so this will ask you where you want to put the caption so below right left so we will say below so the caption has been created below so we can type the name of the image file goes here so you can type the name of the image file this is actually one of the common uses of scripts python scripts uh inside scribes so trust me you can it's very easy to learn python and uh, you can yourself customize your own python script to ensure that uh, you play around with the uh, layout inside scribes so let me show how to run a script which is created which is not present inside scribes which was actually created by me i will show you how to do it so we will go to execute script then i have placed a script inside my desktop so i will select the image wizard python file so here this is a small image wizard script you can scale the image say to 50% and then you can align the image to the center like this you can flip the image all these things the moment you click select and click it will execute the uh, image visa so we'll scale it to 50% so it will automatically get scaled when you use the uh, script so now you can do this uh, info box and see what happens so we need to have a text frame for using the info box so i have a text frame let us go to scripts So here you can go ahead and create this 
information so the dimensions are clear you can click the text so it is done sir so, this is how you manage to go ahead and use a script to create a information box so now let us go and create a calendar so you go and create some more pages insert say calendar as well man so we will create somewhere around 15 16 pages this is where we are going to create the calendar i go to the script scrub a script and then i will go to the calendar visa so i need to choose one month i need to say i need an english calendar so english then classic calendar type week begins with monday the year i need to do a calendar for the entire year i just choose all the months and then draw if you want a image frame i just draw the image frame just click ok double sided yes now the calendar has been created now what happens is the calendar has been created now you see for every month is created now i can add an image here so i can select an image and paste here so let me see what uh, if I have an image in the downloads folder. I will try to copy and paste this image there. You can copy and paste the image like this. The same image can be incorporated into all the image frames of the calendar and the calendar can be printed. Supposing you want to have an important image, you just create a image frame over it, align it in such a way that it fits into the box and then get image and go to the download folder see whether i have any images there so it is just crashed let me go ahead and redo it again so I will go ahead and go to the script calendar wizard I want a English one I want to choose January I want the whole year around so, so the calendar is being generated yes done so almost uh, all the months are available I will create a image frame here So I can go ahead and choose a image from the desktop. Or let me go to the downloads if I see whether I have any images. image here's one image so we will at least go ahead and do it i'll redo this it has hit a bug i suppose i will go to the script go to the calendar wizard i want an english calendar i want to choose the first month i want a whole year for the calendar this, uh, that is done calendar january month similarly all the 12 months will be listed here similarly so all the 12 months are listed now i will put a frame here image frame here to accommodate the image 
then I will go to get image then I will go to the desktop go to the desktop yeah I'll do this try to get this image looks good so now I import this image so similarly you can import any number of images for each month you import an image ensure that click here and adjust image to frame or we will adjust frame to image sign fine it is done so similarly you can import images to all the months and you can generate a calendar which can be printed so we will resize it so that it look better so, or you can increase the size to cover the entire field yeah this is it so now this is the way you import the picture for each month and you can print the calendar in multicolor so there are other uh, useful scripts which are available so for example you go to the script and then align image to frame you can use so for example you want to align the image to the top left if you click align it gets aligned so uh, that is one of the major uses of these scripts i have told you about caption i have told you about if you want to know what fonts are installed into your system just click this this will show you the all the available fonts within the system this actually shows me actually with the, my system the fonts contained in my system are displayed here and the same print same uh, font can be chosen and uh, included with the font list of scribes same thing if you choose this do this it gets included so that is how you can play around with importing fonts which are already available in the system you can push it onto scribes for the so that your software can make use of the font thank you very much for your patience